Today's the day of the Iowa Jeep Show, and I already have my army truck down there, but I'm going to take Popcorn, my Jeep Truck Challenge truck from last year. I've done a little bit of work on this truck, and I want to see if it will, number one, make it there, and number two, make it around the course, do some testing with it, because Kevin has alluded that maybe we are going to do another Jeep Truck Challenge here in a couple weeks. So I want to get some testing done, see if this truck works, or if I need to go and find another truck real quick. Well, the Discovery made it down here. You can see my army truck in the background. Let's take a look around. Well, it looks like we're having a really good turnout this year. I think we have the largest military class that we've ever had here. I just got a call on the radio that there's an AMC Eagle up here causing trouble. And I think that's our buddy Kevin. So let's go check out and see what is going on up here. Got some insulated duct tape going on here. What's, what's this? Like a single wrap's good for 20,000 volts or something? Well, Kevin showed up with his AMC Eagle, actually made it here. He's going to take it out and see if he breaks it. He said if it breaks, maybe he'll leave it here and we can drive over it. But real leather. I'm going to die. So how do you feel about the success for today? Um, I think if we drive out, that is the success. What if you don't drive out? Can we make it a success anyways? We can call it a success, but who knows if it actually will be. So I think if you send it, you could probably embarrass a bunch of Jeeps that are out here. That's, that's the plan. We're like, let's buy this $50 car and then go whoop on some Jeeps with like $400 in parts. Oh, I feel like we need to be wearing helmets in here. I, I brought one. I brought one. We should have put a GoPro on the... <laughs> we got lost the camera. <laughs> All right, we're broken down on the course now in the wooded trail. I'm in the driver's seat. I don't know how I got roped into helping with this. What are we doing? Oh, going. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. drive or two-wheel drive? Just... We have drive. I think we should be thankful for that. Yeah. <laughs> so, yes. Alright, yeah. I can't believe you're letting Cassie drive. I mean, it was only 50 bucks. How bad can it get? Look, no, no hands. <laughs> Just kidding, I'm using my hands. Oh, oh the power's steering. What the heck? The engine's not on. Hell yeah. <laughs> 
Let's see if the Land Rover breaks down or has enough power to go over the obstacles. I'm going to go through the wooded trail first. Here's the trail entrance. The truck seems to be running all right right now. I just know that it's down on power.
Acorn has done everything that I've asked of it today. I can't believe that this Land Rover is still running, especially after the cheap truck challenge last year when I got back and I took the spark plugs out of the engine and I found out that they had been burnt completely away. The spark plugs did not even have any tips left on them. I don't know how the car was even running. I did have some vacuum leaks on the intake, which have been repaired now. And it looks like that was the major issue. I can't believe that I drove this truck here, drove it on the trail, drove it on the course, had no problems, didn't get stuck. So this gives me faith to maybe put some more time into this truck. So if I don't see anything interesting pop up for sale in the next week or two, I'll probably put some more time into this truck and develop it further for the Cheap Truck Challenge coming up in a month. As always, if you want to see more videos like this, comment below and click subscribe.